pink poodle this is my pink poodle Maisie and she's from the east end like me and we are pink poodle aren't we anyway put Maisie aside and today we all know what time of month it is it is da -da 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 -da. enchant and soap Enchant and Soap is a small business that I champion along with quite a few people and two of my friends which is Priscilla Dreadful and Journey Into The Realm I'll put their um, channels down below so you can have a look at their unboxings but this is my unboxing that I do every month and it is their monthly box and it has different themes and I can't remember what this theme is actually um, but um, I know next month is Alice in Wonderland and then the one after that is you can either have um, Sanders and Sisters or Adam's Family and I've gone for the Adam's Family but I think because they have a cutesy range and a um, what do they call it? oh mate, I can't remember what the, the range is called, Twisted Range this is the cutesy range and um, I opt for this one. I know this one for the Twisted was the Teddy Bears. And I know Priscilla Dreadful is going to be doing that one. So look out for that. But this is my one. And it comes like this. It costs £29 a month. And you can have it on Afterpayers, which I do. So it makes it much easier for me to... So it's on my screen now. So it makes it much easier for me to... Um, so set on my screen. Um, easier to me to pay. Um, so yeah, I know that. And also, if you use my code, Pink Poodle Ten, you'll get ten percent off of um, anything. Do you think you know which are, um, anything wrong with this picture? Put it in down below before I turn off and put it on to see if it was so right. Can you guess what the difference is? Are you correct? I forgot to put earrings in, and these are my one, my lovely pairs that I got from. Okay, there you go. Interruption from Paul. They're Monique. That's for you. Yeah, these are from um, Alley Cats Crafts. Oh, I can't say it now. Alley Cat Craft UK. I'll list the um, video down below where I do an unboxing of them. But they're so cute. I know that one's gone up, but there's another one to go up, which I ain't up with, but yeah. Anyway, get back to Enchantment Soap. So Enchantment Soap is a lovely, it's a, one, it's a small business, a bit like Ali Cat's Craft Company. And her, um, it's run by a lovely lady called Claire. And <clears throat> her children help with all the packings and stuff. And I absolutely love her, her company. I don't use really anything else but this now. Like my bath, whatever. Obviously, I've got stuff I've got to use up, but I wouldn't want... I wouldn't go back and buy any of this stuff now because I have it here. But yeah, I'd just go with it and see if you love it too. All you need to do is try it. My daughter has made a... Uh, I'm so happy she's made an order. And she went, look, Mama, use your can, can um, this can. So even like I say, my daughter and my daughter, you know, they love it. And my granddaughter too. So when you, it comes in a box and it has that lovely... Um, one minute, I'm just kidding. Wraps in um, brown paper with a um, like um, what do you call it? Like a tape with the Enchant and Soap um, logo. And then when you open it up, the box is always wrapped in this beautiful, beautiful paper. This is the Enchant. So, so this is all across the tape, like as you will. And this is the way it's wrapped in. And inside you've got Enchant and Soap as well. So I always like to keep this because I wrote some of my um, my granddaughter's um, present in it when it was her birthday. So it's really lovely. It's too good to get rid of. So, right. And then it comes in this. And on top, you get your invoice. Now, normally you get a nice wax melt, but she's put a sticker there this time. She's kind of upsetting because I like the wax melts. And it just tells you what you ordered. And it says monthly. Oh. And oh, I haven't showed you all of her um, card have I yet. Oh, I'm slacking, aren't I? Where is all my bits and pieces? Do you know what it is? I'm recovering from going on Pride yesterday, which is the 1st of July. And I am really tired, and it was well worth going. 
from I can't find a um a card off hand. I have so many of them and I can't find them. But anyway, all the details will be down below anyway. And um I'll in fact I'll put a picture here of all the information here now. Right, and we're back. So this is how it comes, open it up. It's a beautiful magnetic box you can store things in after. It's too good to chuck away. I still put a bit of stuff in these now. And it's got lovely tissue paper you can use again, which I do. And then we have what's inside. I'm not going to show you my sneak peek because I'm, I feel that way today. So, now, first of all we have a bath, bath bomb and it's called Hand of Fatima bath bomb oh it smells lovely everything's all nicely packaged so it won't break Tampa Fatima that was used recently on something I watched and it, oh it was the um the thing about the vampire who was um um Muslim vampire and you, instead of like going across to the vampire for him you have to get the hand of Fatima so that's that it smells lovely and the colours are beautiful and it's very pride sort of like vampire a rainbow inspired so that's really nice to get something like that it smells lovely then we have a body oil and this one is nag champa body oil this must have like an asian theme we're we'll going through it because there's some other bits in there looks like that right, so so, um, Southeast Asian, I think, like that, and this smells really lovely. And it's, um, it's sort of like orange in thing, and it just melts into this lovely oil. It smells really lovely. And I've got an oil here that we had um, a little while back in the, um, Valentine's uh, one, which is exotic. So yeah, I use this, uh, so yeah, that's really nice. It's a different, different uh, thing. How much to get in this? Does it say? No, it doesn't say how much is in it, so I can't see it anyway. It's too tiny for me to see. Oh, 10 grams, 10 grams in here. I've just seen this one now. I think it's all to do with what the um, what goes in it. But this smells really nice. It smells really lovely. It smells very pure as well. Um, what's he got in it? So, there's that. <clears throat> Following on that theme, we have a Nag Champa um, whip soap. It looks like it smells the same. It smells very nice. I'm going to give this to someone I know that I think might like it. Um, yeah, so it's really lovely. There's that. It's got nice. I don't know what, what is it? That's a fan. I could I remember Southeast Asian fan. So this is, I think it's a South Asian, Southeast Asian inspired thing. So this is the Blossom Tree Flower Foamer. Yeah, it's definitely Southeast Asian. Yeah. Sorry. Um. Yeah. Has it been around Chinese New Year or something recently? Is that what it is? And this is the Mulan Body Butter. I love their body butters. Mum, do you want to smell? It smells so, oh, it smells like passion fruit. It's got that passion. And they're so, and the only thing is, when it gets too hot, they melt because as you can see, they're oil based and like, oh, they're just so luxuriously. My skin has never felt so soft. Since using this, oh, it smells it's uplifting. I love this smell. 
It smells absolutely gorgeous. I don't know what it is. It's like, it just smells really nice. Like, like sweetie, but like citrusy at the same time. It's really lovely. And then we've got this here, Angel Wings Room Spray. Oh yes, and how much is in this is the, um, I could never see this. Um, 85 grams in that. And then this says, uh, I don't know so much is in it. Oh, 10 grams of this. And this is Angel Wings Room Spray. No, oh, it smells lovely. And I've, I've also got um, some of that one. And I've got a couple of room sprays here already that I use, which is the white one. To, he has to ruin my videos, doesn't he? So yeah, so that's really nice. And last but not least, we've got the Vanilla, vanilla and Tahiti Wax Melts. So these are all two coats, two toned. You've got the pink and the grey. Oh, that smells nice. Oh, that smells something like um, tropical beachy type smell. Um, I will, uh, I yeah, so what was I saying sorry about that I thought I could get the cats but they're not wanting to comply so we've got these lovely um, uh, wax melts that are vanilla and Tahiti and they really do smell lovely they smell like a holiday we've got the vanilla you've got the Tahiti I think you've just seen Holly go past there maybe you can see how she's oh, she's just jumped down she don't want to know alright so um, there's that there's the bath shower which is the blossom tree shower so I think this is kind of like um, um, South, um, South Asian themed. Angel Wings Room Spray it smells really lovely. Put it up again because it smells really nice. It's nice and subtle. It's very nice. Then we've got the Hand of Fatima um, in rainbow colours. Bath bomb really nice we've got the Mulan body butter that is so gorgeous I've actually got on my skin I could smell it on my skin down so I can still smell it it's absolutely gorgeous this one I love this one it's the Mulan one and then we've got the Nub Champa um, soap smells very nice and the Nub Champa oil which is quite nice on the body as well and Oh, it says 10 minutes on the bottom. So, oh, I didn't know that. You saw this one? Yeah. Yeah, it says 15 mils on that, and this is 10 mils. You can see. Oh, now I know where to look. So, there you go. So, I've learned something. So, we've got that. So, that is my July box from Enchanting Soap. If you did enjoy this video or you'd like to get a, anything from there at all, please use my code PINKPOODLE10 to get 10% off of anything. And thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a pause up. And if you're new to my channel, hello and welcome. It's nice to see you. And if you've come back to watch me again, thank you so much for coming back. For people who haven't subscribed, thank you for coming too. I really do appreciate all the support and love that I get from you. Thank you for all the comments. I know sometimes it takes me a while to comment back, but I do read your comments and I really love seeing them. I love seeing what you think about my hair. I was going to say about Billy, but of course Billy's not here no more. What you think about the cats? Um, yeah, still adjusting. It's been... Um, yeah, it's been two months today since Billy passed away, so time goes quick. And, um, yeah, it's very difficult. I must admit, I, I do find it hard without him because he was always a big part of this um, channel, same as Dora. And you can see my mum's dog, Goldie, in the background there. It was my mum's dog when I was growing up. So, anyway, take care, everybody. Look after yourself and keep... Well, and I will see you in the next Pink Poodle too. Take care and always remember, it is what it is and it ain't what it ain't. Until next time. Bye. Mwah.